Okay. There. Okay. Hello, everybody, and welcome to uh, Secret Mono Randomizer Weekly Seed number 990. Oh, man. <laughs> wow. Long way. That's a lot of that's a lot of random seeds. Um, all right, we've got a vanilla long goal. Um, double experience, double gold. Uh, bosses or everything levels when you level up. I don't see any notation here, so I believe it's swap bosses random enemies. I think is the the standard. Here, let me see that. I forget what the standard is. I wish that it would just say what it is. Random bosses swapped enemies. Add it backwards. Random bosses swapped enemies is the standard role. There's no information, so. So, random bosses. So, we could have repeats. Swapped enemies. Uh, chest traps. None. Chest drop frequency. High. So, <laughs> lots of chests, all of which are good things. We will have no chest traps. They will give you either gold or items. Um, find both characters at current level. Restric restrictive logic. So, pretty pretty friendly seed, all things considered. Um, let me make sure I've got the right one open. Five, eight, yeah, that's right. Starting with the boy. Wow. Okay, is this ready to go? It is. Okay, I'm recording. I'm just double checking everything here. Okay, three, two, one. Bep. All right, vanilla long, which means we need to figure out what orbs are locking the mana palace, the grand palace. Uh, unlock all of those in order to get access to the uh, mana fortress and then fly up there and go through and beat Flammy. Spear? What kind of spear we got? Just out of curiosity. Strength and stone. Oh my gosh, nice. Okay. So we have a, a very strong spear to start with. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna pick up my I'm gonna add my, my usual opening. Get as many freebies as possible. And then go to Pandora. Leaving guys naval um to do that in one swoop. I've evolved my strategy a little bit over time. <laughs> Money. Money's nice. Okay, since I have money, I'm gonna go ahead and check the shop. Nothing. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna leave this alone then. Okay, this shop is dead. Nothing here that I really want. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even, hold on, wait. I've lost my mind. I didn't even copy down what the Elder told me. Did I even talk to the Elder? I'm losing my mind. Oh, what a time loss. Out the gate, I'm losing my mind. Oh, it was nothing. Okay, that's why. That's why I didn't write it down, because it was, it was a bullshit nothing. Okay. Off to a great start. Really got my head in the game right now. Dark seed in a house, okay. Dryad seed in a hole, okay. Not undine, okay. Glove in Pandora. Axe behind Gnome Orb. Okay. Alright. Yeah, it was a nothing hint from the Elder, which is why <laughs> I, I didn't write anything down. I was like, wait a minute, did I talk to him? Because I did stuff out of uh, the normal way that I would do things. So still got 300 gold that we're floating.
Okay. Good, we can go ahead and get that chest after Matango. If there's not armor here, oh, go in the door. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and get uh, candy while I'm here. Oh my gosh, this is expensive stuff. I'll write down Needle Helm. I may not need it. Needle Helm Matango. I doubt I'll need that, but that's something that everybody can wear. You know, that gives incredible defense. So if it comes to the point where I'm just like floating 15,000 gold for no reason, then uh, I'll check the shop first. See if there's anything worthwhile here. Since I may be coming back here, since I already have the gold key, you know. Um, no, nothing here. Okay. Too rich for my blood. We're just going to get this first trust and then bail. Now, I do have access to the second chest, so I need to remember to come back here. Uh, whether or not... <laughs> whether we come here before we have the light seat or not is going to be a choice. <laughs> uh, that's um really bit me in the ass before is me not getting that second chest and it having something necessary hmm. okay Chrissy then shop I keep saying Chrissy is it Chrissy or Christy I think I've asked this question 30 times and then never actually looked it up. Fire final, some gold. Okay. Um, okay. Can I get that? No. Okay, at least have something for the boy. Cool. Okay. So with everything being level one, I should just be able to dodge through stuff. Ah! Because I have, uh, armor. In every slot, yeah. So it should be safe. Oop. Boomerang orb and bow orb. I might as well open this up. It's gonna be a good thing no matter what. Oh fuck! I don't want this. And chocolate. Okay. I just wanted to pick up the thing, not kill two men. I didn't want to murder two dudes. I just wanted to pick up the treasure chest. You know how it is. Ah, controlling is awful right now at Glove Orb. Okay. I have no reason right now, as far as hints are concerned, to go to the back area. So I won't!
Lots of glove orbs. All right. We're going to get that glove orb in, or that glove in Pandora, and then it's going to be just... I'm going to punch everyone to death. <laughs> All right. Okay, fine. <laughs> fine. Nothing. There's the dark seed in a house, okay. Whip orb. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Come on. <laughs> All the way. Then we go up the west coast. We can do Tasnica, Turtle Island, check out the orbs at um, Fire Palace and Moon Palace. I'll check Kakara shop, why not? I normally don't. Feeling like it today. Don't know why. Just, just damn. Cool. The dryad. Okay. in the way. Can't land on a tree. Uh, no. Nothing worthwhile. Okay, good. This shop's dead.
Okay, let's go get our hints at um, Mandala, and then around Gaia's navel, and then we'll go to um, uh, Pandora. Ooh, okay. What is this? Raccoon Cap and Kung Fu. Cool. Decent armor for the girl. Um, early game. Uh, but that Raccoon Cap is good for everybody, so... Luna, okay. Mech 3 weapon, don't care, I'm gonna do that anyway. Lumina in mountains, okay. Booty, booty rush. You dry it, already know that. Gnome behind waterfall, ooh. Great hint. Sword in a chest, okay. Seed late. Shade underground. Oh! That was weird. I don't know if that's going to come through in the recording, but everything froze for a second there. Uh, this little girl needs to get the fuck out of the way. Three, two, one, don't care. Oh! That... NPC has to spawn somewhere else. I hate it so much. Around the corner, please. Nothing. Okay. There's a hint north of... Pandora, and then we start blowing stuff up. We start going absolutely ham. Oh, came for the whip. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to Pure Lands, everybody. At some point, we need. Uh, don't care about any of that. I guess I could have bought the ribbon, but, like, eh. Okay. These notes are all out of whack. Okay. So the axe is behind a gnome more The sword is in a chest. So we're going to hunt down the sword first. First thing we're going to do is go get gnome, which should be behind a waterfall. It should be in, um... Uh, Undine Cave. And then, in a chest, I mean, that could be, you know, the second chest at, um, what is it called? Um, in the White Palace, in Gold Tower. Good diagonal, doofus. We also have uh, two chests, of course, in Guy's Navel that we can check. So, a chest all over the place. Also, the sword could be locked behind one of the things that you need an axe for, you know? Uh, so.
Now we wait. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. Quite doing enough damage. Oh, come on. Jerk. This sucks. Long cycle for this fight. So the whip is in a volcano. I'd like to go ahead and get a cutting weapon before I go there. It may be one of the first three um, things in Pure Lands, but I'd rather have a cutting weapon to get through. Okay, we're gonna go to who, um... The waterfall first. We're gonna go to... The cave. Ah, nothing worthwhile here. Okay. Notes! Notes are hard. <laughs> well, there it is. We can upgrade it about a thousand times. Okay. Spear orb. There's the sword. Awesome. Money. The sprite. Who has what? The bow. Okay. Sword orb. And a spear orb. Okay. Okay, let's get Gnome first. Gnome and the Midge Mallet. I like it. Oh, 
Okay, guys, naval. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm going to look at armor first. Eh, I guess for this for us collectively. Fire seed, okay. We just got 500 gold, and then we have some other stuff. Okay. Um. Sure, why not? Wait, hold on, wait. Is this for both of us? No. Okay. Yeah, you get this. And then I can get this and we can trade out. Okay. So you'll have a little bit of everything. Okay. Okay, that was all our money. <laughs> Which is fine. If the whip's important. Yeah. That should level up the sprite and give us our stuff back. And we have three seeds now, so like, you know, let's get these levels a-going. There's the light seed. Okay, oh wait, did I have a hint for that? Yeah. Well, now I can go finish that too. I didn't have a hint for the light seed. No, wind seed late. Okay. God, all these seeds. Okay, so I could finish that up as well. Um, or do I rush the whip? But I don't know what else is like needed in Pure Lands, you know? We leveled up. There's shade. Okay. Let me check money real quick. That was Luna. Oh, I can't. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I can't check money. That's one of the things that's so weird. Oh, but now I can. <laughs> now, now it's now it's done. Oh, wait. 400. Okay. Okay. Uh... I mean, I guess let's do this.
Axe behind Gnome Orb. Maybe that Earth Pat, like, get the whip and then go back and do Earth Palace and get the axe so that you can get, like, Lumina in the mountains or something like that. Like, who knows? What weapons do I have? Let me see. Dragon damage, Dryad. Strength. Well, let's see what we steal here. Looks like a bunch of ones. Ugh. There we go. Hopefully this will be it. This is a weird fight. There we go. Okay. Go ahead and turn on the light seed, and then I think what I'll do is gather up um, stuff that I need and go to the end of the go go to um, Pure Lands so and just clear it. Go get Raccoon Cap or something like that, and level up level up some weapons. Was that 721? Okay. Bunch of chocolate, I'm not gonna knock it, but it's just kind of like, eh. Okay, well I've got plenty of healing, okay. But I got some money out of that, which is important. Oh, I used it all up. Oops. Is that five casts? I'm so confused. Well, there's a lot of damage.
There we go. Okay, cool. So this is turning into the light seed. Um. Then I'm gonna go to Mandala and get a raccoon cap for the boy. I still haven't seen any like good armor though. <sighs> oh, wrong way. Strength and stone. Awesome. Um, I'm gonna go check Ice Country shop and then. I guess we'll do Mandala and then try... I, I, I don't know. It may be kind of early to try and push through everything right now. Oh my god. Awesome. Okay. We're coming here a little early, but that's fine. We've got some magic. There it is. <laughs> I was like, was that from my attack or what? Oh, this should say 2x2g. I guess I didn't finish like editing things out. This is this is wrong up here. It's double double experience, double gold. We leveled up. Finally, it's nothing. Okay, well.
Boom. And back to full magic in case we didn't level up. <sighs> we're, we're zipping through. We're trying to, at least. Oh, good, we didn't level. Awesome. There's dryad magic, which is necessary. Cool. So, so far, this has been extremely necessary to do this. Should be a one and done thing since it has a weakness. Okay, we'll just we'll just clear this whole thing, and whatever money we make, you know. Man, I haven't seen any like mid tier items really. South Town, I didn't check. Um. I'm trying to think of some others that I, like, haven't been to yet. How many of these can I safely cast? Three of them. Okay. Ah, that's good magic. Thank God we have four seeds. This should do it. There we go. Okay. We are looking for the whip. This may be the whip. I mean, in a volcano, I think this is the in a volcano situation. Like, maybe not. Maybe it's just somewhere around here. We did we level up, or did we just? There it is. Okay, we're gonna keep going though, because we don't know. It's three more bosses. We're already like, or two more bosses. We're already like most of the way there. So let's just keep going. Because we don't have a hint for the girl. We don't know what else we need. Next thing we're going to do is... Um, I guess go turn this into the axe. Forecasts. One. Two, three, four, and then we'll steal magic.
One more boss. Whip and Volcano. We got that. Awesome. May not need the Axe Orb. Except Lumina's in the mountains, and I'm like, we gotta, we have to have the Axe Orb for that. I don't know if we need Lumina, though. We need, we don't have the girl yet, so. There's the Wind Seed. Awesome. We'll have a lot of money. Um. All right. We fucked. <gasps> oh right, Gigas's are backwards. Um. Well, this is a problem. Okay, it's cool. I've stone weapons. I forgot the Gygus's work like that. Windseed, late game, we found that. All right. All right, cleared pure lands. We got a cup, we got a seed, we got a whip, we got dryad spells, which were necessary. We did not level up. We need to remember to take a nap. Okay, uh, yeah, after this... Man, what shop do I want? Would I, have I not visited? Like, all these shops have been crap. What shop have I not visited yet? Southtown. That's about it. It's something. Okay. We're gonna go to, gonna go to Mandala to get a raccoon cap for the boy first. Oop, oh, not you. Come on. How much money do we have? 4,000, okay. Ooh. A few. Okay. Awesome. Okay, let's go get the ax. I assume that's important. I assume we find the girl. I need to also figure out like what things we need. But so far, as far as equipment, we're ready for the end of the game. We just need to know whether or not we need to get to the end of the game. I'm not gonna level up the sword at strength right now, so eh. I'm not gonna bother with it. Uh, I think I'll jevel, level up the javelin a couple of times though. I'm losing my mind. Dark humanoid and int. Okay. We still need to take a nap to get all of our stuff back. All 
All right, hopefully this leads to the axe. Dried seeds in a hole. Oh, wow. Good level. Good level up. Good job, everybody. It's important to level up the sword, too, once we get the girl. We'll be able to supercharge everything. Rip in peace. Don't know why I stopped. I cared a lot. This should give us... Okay, so we've turned in... Uh, after, I mean, this should give us the axe, and then it's like, let's turn in the wind seed, let's turn in the dark seed. We don't need to turn in the fire seed. And then, I don't know, let's go check the end of the game. There's a lot of stuff we still have left, so I don't know what all is necessary, but like, let's just go check some stuff out. Let's go get some information, you know? That's what I'm feeling. Uh, let's do this first. Let's get lost in the fucking mountains. There we go. Okay. Okay, so this is four checks. Because it's the two chests as well as turning in the dark seed. And then after that, yeah, let's check the end of the game before doing anything else. Tried seed in a hole. What other holes are there? Potos could be dry and seed. Let's do that next. So we can just full clear everything there. Mantis hands. Alright, after this is Mantis Ant, and then we're gonna go do a bunch of stuff at the um on the final continent. There's Lumina. Okay. Awesome. Uh don't know if we need that. Uh, haven't found the girl yet, so we'll find out. Thank you. 
Awesome. Uh, axe behind Gnome Orb, Lumina, and Mountains found that. Dry it in a hole. Okay, so we're going to go to Potos, and hopefully that, I mean, that's the only one that I can think of that's left that's in a hole, is Mantis Ant. And then we're just going to go and do a bunch of stuff in Tree Palace. We'll also need to level up our armor. Moon Seed is a thing that I can go to. Okay, we'll do that. Let's go do that real quick, because that's, that's two drops. <sighs> also, just quick check real quick. You... 6,000. Ugh. Ugh, where's the armor? Where's the affordable armor? Like, I don't even remember seeing, like, gold armor, ruby armor. I normally write those down. I didn't see them anywhere. Okay, after this is... Ow. Yeah, I really need some armor. sword orb. Eh. Okay. What did Potos even have? Like, or, or not Potos. Yeah, Potos. Um, I don't think it's anything even affordable. Ugh, no. <laughs> okay. I mean, I wrote down not Potos. Um, but I thought it was just maybe, like, stuff I couldn't afford. This fucking guy. I'm going to South. Yeah, I'll go to Southtown after this. Southtown has to have armor that I, I can actually afford. We're at an hour mark. Southtown has to have something. I'm just going there to shop. There it is. Okay. Okay, if Southtown has nothing, then I guess we're just gonna go do stuff at the end of the game. We're just gonna clear shit. So I'm still missing Sylphid and Salamando and the girl. Um, oh, baby. Okay. Um, I'm gonna wait. Okay. 
Boom. Okay, if we find the girl, she can wear the um, other crown, she can wear the fancy overalls, and she can wear the um, bracer or whatever. Okay. Yay! Brilliant. Okay. Let's blow up this stuff first. Oh wait, let me let me switch with you real quick. Okay. So we know we don't need Undine. So the girl is out there, which gives us access to casting Lumina, and then Sylphid and Salamander are somewhere else. But this will give us good info. Nothing and a javelin orb. Okay, I pressed the B button. Let me through. Let me out. Release me. We'll do three casts here because I think he has a weakness to it, so... Save us some time. One boss to fight upstairs, and then we are going to... Oh, man. Do we do Undersea Continent before we do Grand Palace? I'm going to go explore the Grand Palace. I'd rather I'd rather have the information and then double back. I mean, I'll take it. Wait, it's gonna transform first. Hold on, wait. So let's go see what we need and whether or not we need to go back out in the world. I have a feeling we do. I have a feeling this is going to be a long... Yeah, uh, welcome to Crash Full Clearing the fucking game. <laughs> I followed my heart. I went and cleared Pure Lands. And what does it get me? Man, a lot of nothing. A lot of nothing. That's spooky. All right, let's go check and see what we need. I'm upset. Because if it's... I mean, there are three things that we don't have access to right now. Lumina, Sylphid, and um, Salamando. 
But it may just be like, this is all you need. I doubt it. Dryad, okay. Now, I know I needed those two. All right, those are gimmies. But that'll at least allow me to peruse the rest of the shit. And I don't have to come back and do that. So. Lumina, okay. So we need to find the girl. And we need Salamando, okay. Well, good, I'm glad I did this actually. All right, I have no hints for those, so it's just get lucky. Which, that's fun. All right, yeah, now it's just like, be lucky. Okay, well, we have information though. That was good. And we cleared the, the bottom row. Be fucking skippy. This is bad. Do I have any ice anything? Probably not. Let me see how much this does first. Oop. I mean, still level 7 magic. Okay, we got the Sunken Continent chest, we got this. Okay, so we need the girl, we need, um... And Salamando. Fucking great, okay. Yeah, we leveled. Okay. Let's not. Let's just not go that way. We don't have to.
Yay, they all have wake-up animations, so we can just sprint through here. Excuse me, gentlemen. All right. Is this possible and was it worth it? Let's see how much damage one of these does. Should be able to seal all this magic so he can't heal, though. Okay, after this, where are we going? Uh, I guess let's turn to the sea hair tail. This was not worth it. Awesome. Uh, we have a lot left on our plate. Or you know what? Yeah, let's turn him. Uh, do I turn to the sea hair tail? I'm gonna. Ah, uh, that's so much flying around. Oh, that's so much flying around. I can't even get into the fire palace, so whatever. I'll do do it just because it's a nothing check. And I can level up my sword while I'm here, I guess. Also, I forgot. Did you have anything I can actually afford? Also, we didn't level up. Ooh, interesting. Not really. Okay. <laughs> okay. Please don't be shit. Oh, oh, I kind of want to reset. I kind of want to reset. Oh, high damage range sucks. Whatever. Okay. All right. <laughs> cool. Let's go do the wind palace and then LNA's. Actually, ugh, or do we climb up and talk to Jack and Jack? If I do that, I'm not going to fight the bosses. Yeah, if I climb the mountain, I'm just up there to get two hints. I'm not gonna fight the doppelgangers. Oh my gosh. Well, this sucks. I need the girl. I need Salamando. And it's just like, I'm going all over the fucking place. Awesome. And I would really like a... Uh... Another sword orb. <laughs> Just so I can level it up one more time. Ugh. Okay. Let's get to LNAs. Let's just keep clearing stuff.
Let's see, I've turned in all the seeds except for the fire seed, which I know, which I can't get to, and is also gold. And, uh... Is that it? No, I've turned, yeah, I've turned in all the seeds. Oh, well, hopefully this will give us a hint as well. Fuck out of here. Oh my god. <laughs> Get out of here. I can't push that dude. Salamander late, okay. What else is late? That's doppelgangers. <laughs> I think that's doppelgangers, yeah. Yeah, I'm looking around at all the different things left. Is doppelgangers. Okay, well, I guess we'll do that. Oh my gosh. Awesome. There it is. All right, we need to put clothes on this girl, and then we need to run up this hill. Um, so hold on, wait. First things first. You. You know, hold something else. Yup! Chaos. Okay. So this should be it. Ah! We have no other, like, late game anythings to do. And after this, we will, uh... Yeah. So, maybe done. We, this may be a sub two? I don't know. Need shade. Already got it. Okay, hopefully, we don't also need sulfur.
Uh, how many of these do I have? Well, the girl automatically dies, the big question. There it is. Okay. Yeesh, this sucks. Gosh, what a hunt. Okay, it didn't make the sound, so I was concerned. <laughs> But we do have Dryad and we have both characters now, so at least the last boss shouldn't be too big of a pain. to go shopping after this. Uh, probably not for armor. Probably just for items. Just boost to Matango real quick and load up and go.
All right, there's that. Okay, yeah, Matango to get items. That's it. Uh, well, I didn't have to do everything. Didn't do North Town, didn't do Ice Country. But man, it was a lot of stuff. Bleh. A little bit of help. A little bit of help there. Okay. <laughs> Alright. 20... I, th I mean, I'm gonna beat this in 28 minutes, no problem. But, unless I hit some, like, incredible snag... Sucker punch the sprite. <laughs> Down and out. Scoozy.
Did it. Okay. There's one down. Hilarious. All right, so Fire Palace was fully locked. <laughs> Good to get that. Dude, Gnome, Luna, hard carry. We're moving at a good clip. Oh, man. And we leveled up. Uh-oh, that's dangerous. I don't want to hit level 8 with my spells. That is really fucking annoying. Oh my gosh. Just neoed my way through that shit. <laughs> All right. I, I think my shade is at level 4, level 5 right now. I don't mind doing a round of shade just to do it. But I may, I may want to just slap the mana beast. We'll see. Let's see what kind of damage we're doing.
long drawn out cutscene. Come on. There it is. Boom. Ugh. Probably could have just used whatever tactics. Shade. Sub two! Yay! Uh. Man, I flew through that, uh. Whatever it's called, uh, Mana Fortress. Flew through it. So far, so good. First place, a, a little bit of sniping from Black Sliver. <laughs> a little bit. Um, I'm in. I'm in the lead with one forty-two oh five. Black Sliver with a one forty-six ten. Good run. And then Solar with a two, even. Hines with a two nineteen, and Cold Drizzle with a two thirty-five. So yeah, it was a it was a long drawn out seed. Um, I guess I got lucky in doing most of the end game checks and then getting that hint that it was the end game and I was like, well, I know where I need to go. <laughs> it's got to be doppelgangers. Um, didn't have to do North Town. Didn't have to do Ice Country at all. <laughs> of course, Fire Palace was locked behind killing uh, the first boss at Mana Fortress. Um, Water Sea was also locked that way. Um, didn't do Matango. But did everything else. But still, I skipped... Seven bosses. Plus Matango. Eight bosses. Um, let's see what people are saying about this. Almost 100% from Heinz. Even did the glove glitch just to get trolled. I don't know the glove glitch. I know of the glove glitch. So what the glove glitch is, is in... Uh, uh, what is it called? Fire Palace. You can... Uh, there's certain items. I think the glove is one. The sword is one where you can... Um, trade things out with with between a uh, your allied. I think you have to have two people, and you have to have them both have like glove at like level one or something like that, like charge up to level one. And there's a ramp. Like when you first walk into Fire Palace, there's a, there are doors off to the right and the left, and the the right goes nowhere, as far as I know. I can't remember the right, as far as I know, goes nowhere. You go to the left, you go across and down, and that takes you to your first orb. And that brings you back up and around and lets you get your first chest. You can skip that orb by jumping up the ramp um, that is blocking the center aisle. Um, and there's a way to do that by like charging your weapon and like jump, like like switching back and forth and progressively like moving, like forcing your sprites up that ramp. Um, I, I don't know 100% like all of the specifics of doing it. I just know like of it, I, you know, and kind of how to do it, but I don't. I've never done it myself. Um, it may be interesting to learn. It's a cool, like, trick, but here, like, you know, I would have gone and done that, and yeah, would have gotten trolled. I don't even know what Fire Palace second one was. Let me see. What is a Fire Palace? Undine, and then Luna and Lumina. So Lumina takes you to the end, which you wouldn't need because it's gold. So you'd have skipped the Undine Orb, which was unnecessary because it was, from a logical perspective, you know, on in the Mana Fortress. So anything past that, those three chests were unnecessary. The boss, of course, was unnecessary. We got the hint that that was just gold. Um, so what were those chests? Let's see. Uh, spear, Orb, Glove Orb, Moogle Belt. So, yeah. Um, uh, so then Solar did it, Black Sliver did it, Cold Drizzle did it. Last location, Salamander, Doppelganger spot, rough. Um, where did I get that hint? Oh, I got that hint at the, um, at the, uh, the doll on LNA's table. Man, that was, that was the biggest clutch for me is going and doing Spiky Tiger because, like, I got the girl and I got the hint that Doppelganger was late game, or that Salamander was late game, and I only had one check left late game, which was Doppelgangers, so. 
Went for hits, ended up trying it with just the sprite and the boy and succeeded. So. Yay! Well, first place. Close! Black Silver with the 146, me with the 142. Very good run. Yeah, this was a tough run. And I mean, like, I... I... Followed and just chose the right stuff. I decided not to do North Town. It could have been very easily. I could have gotten punished by doing that stuff. But I went and swept through a lot of the other things. Also, like, the hints that I got, like, dried seed in a hole, like, went and did, um, Photos Village, and then turned that in. I think it was, like, a, it was, like, a thousand gold or something like that. It was unnecessary. It was, like, whatever. Um. Anyway. My biggest thing was just armor. It was just finding armor. I spent so much time shopping. So this is what I spent so much time checking for shops for affordable mid-game armor. Everything was either low tier or super late game. Finally found gold armor and tiger crown in Southtown shop. Didn't do Northtown bosses or Ice Country bosses. Absolutely flew through the fortress. Carried by Sprite with Gnome plus Luna and lots of seeds. GG. Alright. That was interesting. Uh and really, like I didn't I get I didn't open a whole lot of chests. I got chocolate. And I will say this, going through doppelgangers, I'm glad I had that chocolate to heal. I mean, I had candy. I had candy that I bought as well, but um, I'm glad I had that chocolate to heal. I'm also glad that I stopped and bought some, um, uh, like, armor and stuff like that. I decided to do that. Um, it wasn't till I, like, I went to Batango because I knew it had uh, Cups of Wishes and, um, what is it? Uh, uh, Fairy Walnuts. And I had a note here, and it wasn't until, like, afterwards that I showed up with over 15,000 gold, was able to buy the Needle Helm. Was it necessary? I mean, like, for the boy, like, I didn't really take much damage going through the Mana Fortress, so that was nice. Um, so, I guess it helped, because I didn't have to worry about that, and I was able to reallocate some, some armor to the girl by giving her um, the gold armor instead. So, yeah. Awesome. Oh, GG. Thanks for tuning in, for watching, everything like that. And uh, y'all take care, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.